Hi everyone! As you can tell by the description of this video, I am doing another cleaning video, which I am actually very excited about. You know those strange people that like to watch people clean out their pores and do kind of odd and awkward stuff? That's the type of person I am. So when I saw this, let's call it sweat stains. I was excited because I have done this cleaning job before three years ago and it worked so well. It helped reclaim a brand new mattress. If you have any of these stains, you know, sweat stains in your mattresses or your kids' mattresses, you will only need three easy ingredients. Ingredients that are probably in your household already. So you'll need 3% hydrogen peroxide, your Dawn liquid soap, Preferably the, the blue one works best, but I have the green one and pure baking soda So you'll also need those are the cleaning solutions But to use it you'll need a heavy-duty spraying bottle, which basically just means that the straw is bigger Baking soda has a hard time dissolving So you need to make sure that it can pass through and a lot of times when you get them They have this weird little filter thing at the bottom you make sure to take that out so the solution is made up of three tablespoons of baking soda. And if you have a funnel, go ahead and use it. I couldn't find it today. So I'm just gonna use this to act as a funnel. Basically. of your peroxide one cup and it's just one drop don't get crazy thinking it's going to clean it any better it's just one drop Oop, that was more than a drop all right You don't want to shake it, you want to kind of twirl it around.
so excited to show the final results of the mattress. I am so, so happy with how it turned out. I'm not sure if the camera can pick it up, but all of the urine stains themselves have totally disappeared. Now I went ahead and did the same procedure two times. So one time was on camera and I wasn't really happy with how it turned out. So I did it a second time. I would advise that if you're going to do it to only do two tablespoons versus the three because there was a bunch of baking soda that was stuck onto the mattress, which is really no problem. All you need to do is just brush it off. But you'll see some of the other stains still there. But overall, you have to be impressed with how the mattress turned out. I am also going to attach pictures of the original where I tried this hack on it. you enjoy this video I enjoyed putting it together for you all don't forget if you haven't subscribed already go ahead and subscribe now I'm going to be uploading a whole lot more cleaning and organization type videos so you want to be notified so hit that bell so that you're notified every time I'm uploading a new video okay take care God bless bye to hit that bell so that you're notified every time I'm uploading as moms